it's blurry because it's not detected. And I'm going to do it like this. Smile, daddy. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's just Janine. And as you can see, I have two special guests with me today. My parents, my dad. Say hi, dad. Hi. And my mom. Hello. So in today's video, we're going to be doing a product review on a package that I received from Try Treats or just Treats. And Treats is a website in which they will send you boxes of treats from different countries, select countries. You don't know what country you're going to get treats from. So I ordered from them and they sent me my box, as you can see here. So I'm going to open it up. I don't know what country my treats are from. So I'm going to open it up for you right now. We're going to find out. So once again, that's, uh, the website is trytreats.com. And this is what it looks like inside of the box. Okay, so we'll open it up. And the snacks are going to be from the Cliffs of Moyer, Ireland. So my snacks for this month are from Ireland. So on the back, it's a hello, it's a postcard. You want to read it? You want to read it? Okay. They don't want to read it. I'll read it. So it says, hello from Treats. This month's snacks come to you from the Republic of Ireland, an island country located off the coast of England, famous for its music, beer production, and its beautiful landscape. The Cliffs of Moyer, depicted on the front of the postcard here, are an example of the enchanting natural wonders that can be found in Ireland. Ireland is also known for its love of potatoes, dating back to the 1700s, and when it became a, and it became when it became a staple food in Ireland, because it was nutritious. Let me read that again. Ireland is also known for its love of potatoes, dating back to the 1700s, when it became a staple food in Ireland because it was nutritional and easy to grow. For a long period of time, potatoes were the primary meal of a large segment of Ireland. As a result, a larger proportion of treats this month are potato chips, or crisp, as they say in Europe. So they say crisp over there, not potato chips like we do. Uh, it says we included some of the best Irish chips, or crisp, and we also included biscuits that are commonly eaten during afternoon tea, which is a light meal enjoyed between three to five people. Enjoy, bon appetit, the treats team. So that was a little postcard and they have a message on the back. So I guess when you get your monthly subscription, you'll get a postcard of the um, place, the location with a little description on the back. And this card shows you what's inside, the different treats that are inside of the box. Get close so y'all can see. So we're going to just try these and one by one see if we like them. If we don't, we got our what? Trusty bags to spit them out. We're just going to try them random. We're not going to go by the car. We're just going to select what we want to try and give you our honest uh, reaction and opinion and uh, go from there. So this is the box. These are the treats that are inside the box. They're nicely packaged. So we're just going to select, you want to choose, you want to choose which one you want to try first? All right, so my dad picked the crunchy. Let's see what this is. Mommy, you want to read what the crunchy is? Yeah, I'm not going to say that. Crunchy is, uh, crunchy by Cadbury is a milk chocolate bar with a honeycomb center. Like its name suggests, this treat is crunchy in texture, and every bit of it generates a flavor of rich uh, milk, milk chocolate, balanced with an airy, light, honey, caramel feeling. All right, so we're going to try this crunchy. We're going to try the crunchy and see how that um, tastes. Open it up and tear off a piece of it. 
So while he's opening that up, I want to send a special shout out to Brandon Wesley. Hey, Brandon, if you're watching, here's your shout out. So <laughs> don't say I ain't did nothing for you. No, I'm just kidding. What'd you say? It's good. My dad said it's good. Mom? Mm -hmm. It's good. Let's take a piece. You ain't got to eat a whole lot. We're just tasting it. Well, good. Okay, he said it's good. Well, I don't see nothing wrong with it. It's good. Mama said it's good. Okay, so let me try. It's got like a honeycomb. Well, I'll show you. It's got like a, like a honeycomb center in it with chocolate. It's almost like... It's almost like a toffee inside. But it here. No, you can't. <laughs> so my mom's gonna make another selection. What did you pick up? Cheese. Cheese and onions. Cheese and onion tatoes. These are cheese and onion tatoes. I guess because they don't say potatoes, so tatoes. All right, so these are cheese and onion flavor, original Irish crisp, made with 100% sunflower oil. It tastes just like a regular sour cream potato chip. So I'll pick the next one. Okay, so these are the Bolin's custard cream. Bolin custard cream. These are looks like cookies. Um Let's see what these are. It says bourbon creams by Jacobs are crunchy chocolate biscuits filled with a smooth layer, layer of chocolate cream and hints of bourbon. Mm. They got bourbon in it. You know what bourbon is? Mm -hmm. yeah. Bourbon. It's bourbon. Bourbon? Yeah, it's bourbon. Like a drink. Like a strong drink. Mm, I taste it, bro. Okay, so we're going to try the custard cream because it got bourbon because <laughs> it got bourbon in it you don't gotta eat the whole thing just just nibble just get a nibble you ain't gotta eat the whole thing no. mm. <laughs> these are good actually they're real airy they're like light um okay so that was the custard creams cookies with the bourbon in it yeah i buy you pick next what's the next thing these are twiglets twiglets are twiglets by Jacobs and twiglets are knobby twig like pretzel sticks coated with peppery yeast seasoning um, twiglets feature the unique flavor of salty marmite accompanied with an oddly addicting crunch all right we're gonna try these Get you. Oh, it's the mouth. No. 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 Oh. Oh. Oh, man. Like That's boring. terrible. <laughs> yeah, that was. It's like a bark. That was awful. 
That's something to knock you out. Yeah, we 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 gonna skip on this one. Uh, you can get done. You can buy that one. <laughs> okay, so these are um get down. Shamrock and sour cream. These are another bag of chips. These are the um mm. shamrock and sour cream. These are potato chips flavored with delicious sour cream and Irish shamrock. Uh, these chips are hand crisp on the Kiao family farm uh, where potatoes have been grown for the past 200 years. All right, so we're gonna try, these are gluten free. sour cream on a uh, potato chip to me okay <laughs> these are marietta's traditional <coughs> plain biscuits um, okay so um these are thin light sweet cookies with a mild vanilla flavor these biscuits are perfect for dipping in coffee and tea or for being used to sandwich a thin layer of syrup or condensed milk hmm. look like cookies Oh yeah, I'm gonna smell it. I can smell it. I can, yeah, it's alright. <laughs> you can smell what? I can smell it and tell it's alright. You can smell it and tell it's alright. That's what they look like. Yeah, I get a glass of milk and eat this one. Mm-hmm. That's alright. That's alright. I buy it. It's got an aftertaste. It's yeah. It tastes like communion bread aftertaste. <laughs> Seems like I've tasted something like that before. It's got a when you eat it, the initial taste is like a sweet cookie, but the aftertaste is like communion bread. Mm. It's gonna taste like communion bread. Mm. The aftertaste. Yeah. I like communion bread. Yeah, it tastes good. Right. Okay, so the next one is called Flake. It's candy. It's a, uh, is it a candy bar? Flake, yeah. So Flake is also by Cadbury and it's a chocolate bar consisted of thinly folded flakes of milk chocolate. Uh, the invention for the flake occurred when the excess from chocolate mounds fell in a stream and creaked and created a flaky folded chocolate. Oh. <laughs> So it is flaky. It's, it's just like it says. It's got a flaky look to it. Y'all can see that? Okay, you don't have to hold your hand out for this one. And I think all it is is just, all it is is really just chocolate, but it's just got a flaky texture. You pinch it and it flakes up. Oh, it's chocolate. It's alright. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I don't like it. It's alright. It's okay. It's just like milk chocolate, flaky mm -hmm. milk chocolate. Yeah, chocolate. Okay, these are the hula hoops. Hula hoops. Hula hoops. And these are potato rings made with 100% sunflower. Uh, they are crunchy, salty, potato crisp, shaped like small rings. The crisp texture of the hula hoops, along with its uh, exotic shape, made them exciting new way to enjoy a snack. So I guess they're shaped like a hula hoop. <laughs> Onion ring? Mm. Onion ring, yeah. 
I mean, it's a, it's a potato ring, but I don't taste no onion in it. I don't taste no onion. Well, it's a potato. Potato? Like a potato. 100%, but it's about 80. About 80%. I buy, I buy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we have now the crunchy bourbon. So I guess they drink a lot of bourbon in Ireland, but crunchy bourbon cream crumbly. It says bourbon, bourbon creams are crunchy chocolate biscuits filled with a smooth layer of chocolate cream and hints of bourbon. They contain high fiber, no artificial flavors, and no preservatives. I like the fact that it has a high, it's high in fiber because fiber is good for you. So we're going to try these right now. But fiber is good for you because, and I can't open it. Maybe I need some fiber. <laughs> <laughs> the cookies have bourbon written on them. <laughs> oh man. So it has the word bourbon written on it and it's got some filling in the middle of some kind mm. yeah. I mean, I taste chocolate, but it don't taste like chocolate. It's got an aftertaste. That might be the bourbon. It don't taste like chocolate. Mm -hmm. I don't know. ain't got no taste to it. Mm. What did it say? Mm. I don't even know what bourbon tastes like because I don't drink. But it's got an aftertaste. Well, it might taste better with milk if you're drinking some milk. Mm. Right and eating it. You want some milk? You know what it tastes like? Some snuff. That's what it tastes like. Some snuff? Yeah. <laughs> what do you know what snuff tastes like? When I was young, I tasted some. Then what it tastes like? Snuff. Ugh. All right, so this is the last one, which is O'Don O'Donnell's of Tipper Tippery. O'Donnell. This is the Hickory Barbecue Chip Crisp by O'Donnell's. These are Hickory Barbecue Crisp, uh, rich um, potato crisp with a unique spicy and sweet barbecue flavor. I'm gonna get... These were the worst. These mm. Twiglets. Yeah, those, was. those were. Y'all want to give it one more try? Mm -hmm. That's what they look like up close. Mm -hmm. Like um, pretzels, but they taste like burnt popcorn. I just want to thank my parents for sharing this video with me and participating in this video and trying these different treats from Ireland. So if you like this video, please give a thumbs up. <laughs> Please comment and subscribe. Once again, it's just Janine. I will see y'all on the next video. See you later.